Hi there. Once you log into your cPanel, if you want to make style changes, you'll go into the style folder. Just double click it. Then uh, right click style CSS, code edit. Then here in the style file, in the styles file, you can you can make any changes that you want. So to make your work easier, I'm using Firefox. I don't know which browser you use. Uh, you install Firebug. You go to the add-ons, Firefox add-ons, then search for Firebug and install Firebug. Once you install Firebug, you can make changes and then transport them to your CSS file. So if I open Firebug by pressing F12, then I click on this to select an element I want to change. If I want to change this, I just come and click on that. And... Uh, so as you can see, I've already changed it to 16. So if you want to change it further, you can just come, uh, try as many different font sizes as you want. So if we do 14 PX, so once you do that, so just come here once you like that and uh, right click then copy rule declaration once you've copied that you go to your style CSS and at the bottom here you have to put it at the end of the file so I'll just paste that in then you come up here and save the changes So if I come back and reload, you will see that the changes are stuck. So the next thing to reduce the spacing up here, I'm going to press F12 to open Firebug. Then I'll just select this. Select the entire container. So as you can see, this is what's affecting the height above here. It's the padding. The padding is too much. So we can reduce this padding to backspace 80px. Then we'll come here and uh, let's just copy the entire thing. Copy rule declaration. And remove what I won't need. There is no need to repeat ourselves. I'll just copy this. So let's come here into our style and paste You'll see that the padding for this has been reduced. You can see the others, they haven't been reduced. So let's open Firebug. So it's probably this one. Yeah, it's the same thing, padding, existing business overlay. So what I can do, since this is just the same as uh, the other one, I'll copy this, then I'll bring it to my CSS file, comma, and that should affect that one. So start a business overlay, existing business, so save changes.
So you can see what I've done, I've grouped all of them. I've grouped all of them here. So I've grouped all of them here. So if you want to make the changes, you can just come here and uh, see what works best. Hmm? You can make the change here just to see what will work best to your satisfaction. Okay, I think that's, that's it for that.